Meanwhile, in Syria, the army has sent reinforcements, including tanks, to the village of Maulula, which has been at the forefront of heavy clashes this week. An ancient Christian sanctuary, Maulula has been besieged by Al-Qaeda-affiliated rebels since Wednesday. RT's Maria Finoshina has gained access to the stricken area. We enter Maulula through its ancient gates, burned and damaged in recent attacks, shortly after the Syrian army announces that most of the militants were pushed back. Signs of a recent battle and destruction are everywhere. We were told to move fast and to follow the military's vehicles without stopping or even slowing down. There are some parts of the road where we have to speed up. Officers still fear there could be snipers around. We hear them shouting, go, go, fast. On one turn, we suddenly stop. So why we stop? It's hard to understand exactly what happened. We only hear a loud boom and feel the earth shake. We get out of the car to take a look around. We're now inside Ma'alula village. It's hard to believe that what used to be one of the most significant shrines of the Christian community all over the world now is a battlefield. Look at this. And then we realized we have landed in the heart of this battle as suddenly bullets started flying around us. We've entered Maalula village with the army, but just, just a few minutes later they told us to get back. The militants launch an attack firing and throwing explosives from the safety of high ground. So this is what we're doing right now. We are coming back to, to the entrance. This is where uh, a, a, a car bomb exploded on Wednesday uh, morning and this is how it all started. After uh, a suicide attack, militants, mostly from Jabhat al-Nusra group, stormed in and since then clashes have been continuing for three days. And as, as you can see, they are continuing now. Soldiers fire shots back, but they can't even see enemy fighters who are cooped up in their hiding places. in Maalulaville right now and they are in uh, Safir Hotel. Uh, this is the mountaintop hotel which was taken by uh, the rebels, the armed rebels on the left uh, day and they are firing even now from that strategic position but also from behind the mountains surrounding the Maalula uh, village and that is uh, where the danger lies because there are many snipers and there are rocket grenades and there are bombs, mortar bombs. Well, as you can see, the situation on the ground is very hard. Uh, you can see that the army is regrouping right now. But the thing is that tomorrow, on Monday, the situation could change dramatically because this is the day when American Congress starts debate on Syria, whether to strike this country or not. The decision made thousands of kilometers away from this battlefield will affect the setup at this military theater. But exactly how is not easy to predict. Marif Noshna Ati from Maalula in Syria.